We are back on zombies. We just got the nail gun, Dark Aether. So if you guys want to see that, that video will probably be up right before this one. But today we're going to be getting the MG82 Dark Aether. Now, as you can see, I have no camos for this gun at all. So I'm going to be grinding this gun start to finish from nothing to Dark Aether. Hopefully there's no bugs on this gun. If there is, I'm going to be a little upset, but... We got to go ahead and make a build for this thing. I'm going to go ahead and put on the Cobra Red Dot. We'll put on the SOCOM Eliminator. And I think I, I want to go either with the Division or the Sword Cutdown Barrel. I, I think the Division's better so, so we can keep some damage range. Ember Sighting Point's fine. I, I'm, I'm torn between Field Agent and Bruiser. I want to have the extra movement speed in case we get to the point where we need to just get going. But also, this gun has been nerfed in Warzone. I don't know if it's been touched in Cold War. So I think the recoil might be a little crazier. Uh, I'm going Bruiser Grip. Might be, it might be a mistake, but I'm going with it. Uh, definitely want the most ammo we can have. And with the fastest reload, speed it might hurt our ads speed a little bit but it's zombies doesn't really matter too much and when we pack a punch it we'll have way more ammo i'm gonna go with the serpent wrap the airborne is good but it ruins our sprint to fire time and our shooting move speed whereas the serpent wrap for five percent less ads speed our sprint to fire time is only affected so we're gonna get that and i think the sas combat stock is probably our best bet here it hurts our hip fire accuracy but our aim walking movement speed is really important for zombies and our shooting move speed is good the raider stock is also very good but i don't know it's between these two. You guys can really pick what you want. I'm going to try out this. And let's change the reticle. I think I'm going to put on this guy. And I think we're all set. Let's go ahead and hop on Firebase Z and see what this gun's like. Pack a punch. One, two, three. How it does against Orda. And if we can get Dark Aether before round 50. I think last time for the nail gun, we got it done around 44, 45, something like that. So hopefully we can beat our last attempt in terms of getting it done faster. Let's go ahead and hop into some zombies. All right, pulling up with the twin here really only have the twin come around to drive me places you know how it goes but we have a little bit of ways to go to get power so i'll see you guys when we got it on give me that open up breaking bad give me Ooh. pop this baby open grind the rail nice give me this let's start this up and that is one camo and one reactor down let me in start it up let's also grab this and that's two reactors down skadoosh can we upgrade this really quick before we leave? No, we cannot. 360 to door. Let's go. Give me that. Good night. That's another camo. Start this up. That's another camo. But we're still racking up camos. And that is another reactor. That's our fastest reactor yet. That's power on during round five. I think that might be a personal record. Gonna grab this loose change. And we will sit right here until we have enough to pack a punch. But so far, we have a very good crit ratio. 69 to 63. Shout out, sex. Pack a punch it. This is what the MG82 looks like. Pack a punch one. Pretty nice coverage. Very, very good. Really wish pack a punch one was a different color though. Hey, mimic. Oh shit! You actually grabbed me. Hey, goodbye. That's another camo and another one. We're flying through these. I think we have enough to grab our first perk, and we're gonna go with quick revive, just in case. Also, this is called the the cool color whatever the fuck that says right there underneath the ammo that's what it's called and the mag now has 300 bullets pretty good if you ask me that's another camo down and another one so we know for sure the camos that were glitched on the nail gun are not glitched for the mg82 we're flying through them all right let's grab dead shot i think next we'll get either speed cola or stamina up we do only have one zombie left so we might as well just do the easter egg really quick but joe you can get another perk for cheap don't care look at me oh come to papa get over here <gasps> Don't think it's bullshit that you can get hit in that. Let's rack up our crits really quick. Oh, I got 26 bullets in this thing. Yeah, ammo is definitely gonna be a problem. I really gotta keep an eye on it. Let's kill them before they disappear. And that's another camo and armor. Wow. And I saw somebody comment on the last video that if you pay attention to the little screen or whatever, whatever color it's at, determines what color weapon you get. And I stopped it on green and I got a gold there. And we've already confirmed way back in when we were first going for Dark Aether that that shit is fake. Now we'll just stay here till we have enough to get the perks that we need right now. We'll get everything but Tombstone and Elemental. Tombstone's useless and Elemental will just take away from our crits. So we'll leave it till we need it. I did not mean to grab that. I'll get Speed Cola. And then next is Stamina Up. Or Stamina Up. People get so mad when you pronounce things wrong in zombies. That's another camo. Now we got enough for Stamina Up. And that is all the perks we need. That's another camo down. All right, off to Colonels. What's up, cutie? Can't forget about you. 
That's another camo. All right, we got a good amount of scrap. Let's go ahead and upgrade this gun. We'll get green and blue, and we're halfway to pink. That's another camo and another one. We're flying through camos. I feel like we're gonna get this done way before we got the nail gun done. And another camo, there's a glacier. There's our assault wave. And we do have enough to pack a punch. So I'm gonna try to run there and pack a punch as fast as I can. All right, there's pack a punch two. This is what it looks like on the MG82. Very, very good. We got one second to get there. Uh, I'm sure, I'm sure it's gonna be fine. All right, a little late to the party, but they have not touched our little thing yet. And I'm not talking about my dick. There's another camo and another one. And there's the assault round. All right, we got enough salvage to do some upgrades again. So let's go ahead and do that. Hopping on the pink and the double armor. Mimic, get out of here. Stupid bee. Get clapped on. Whoa, a mangler? Oh man. Oh no, a mimic? Oh, that was so rough, guys. All right, that's the end of the round. We have enough to get Pack-A-Punch. I probably should have left a zombie, to be honest, but I think we can get through it. All right, we have Pack-A-Punch 3. Um, I'm going to grab an ammo mod, too. I'm putting Cryo on it. And now it's our last stand. Oh, shit. We're actually kind of just slaying through them, honestly. Wait, maybe not. Let's get this max ammo so we don't have to reload. Perfect. And we'll sneak a Funkadelic cam on our way out. We've made it back home. And that's Assault Wave number two. Let's go take this out. Also, this is what Pack-A-Punch 3 looks like. I didn't get a chance to show it off because we were kind of at war, but very, very nice. I really like how Pack-A-Punch 3 looks. And that is probably the fastest Assault Wave I've ever had. Honestly, really surprised. We're 22 rounds in and I have not had to buy ammo once. It's all just been from ground pickups, from specials, and just from pack-a-punching. Not bad. All right, we're on the coolest round there is, round 26. We have enough to get this thing to gold, so we're going to go ahead and do that. And we don't have enough for vault armor yet, but we should soon. All right, we're at 1,000 crits, 1,100 illuminations. We're, we're staying pretty good on our crits here. So we don't have too much more to go, just 1,500. So we got to do everything we did plus 500, which honestly, for, for zombies challenges, not that bad. Uh, I think our last zombie is stuck, so I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can get armor tier three really quick. And I can, let's go, we're fully stacked out. Oh, a little mangler stuck. Goodbye. All right, it's round 29. This is my first time I'm buying ammo at all. It took me 29 rounds to need to buy ammo. That's way better than I was expecting, to be honest. There's the bloodshed camo. That's 1,500 kills. Not too far behind on crits either. Uh-oh. Gotta reload. Hold on. It's round 32 and order still hasn't showed up. Maybe he's scared. Uh-oh. Holy, so much going on. Now order wants to come. Were you stuck in traffic, buddy? I think he was just waiting until I used my ring of fire so he could show up. Come on in, pal. All right, here he comes. Let's see how this thing does against him. I'm just laying down on the trigger. It's actually done a lot of damage to him so far. We already got him almost halfway with one clip. Don't you yell at me. Oh, shit. Come on, let's, let's grab a few crits really quick. Maybe we can get a ring of fire. Hey, there's our crit camo. Maybe that was the pack-a-punch one. I don't know. Oh, there's his prolapse. Oh, this thing tears Orta up. He didn't even get into the map yet. Look at that. He's all the way back there. This thing's nasty. Let me grab my rewards. And now we're back home. A thousand crits to go and we're out of here. This shit is hectic as hell. These are the rounds I live for. When it's nothing but zombies coming at you, you throw on the ring of fire and you just melt. Oh, but this isn't fun. Having to reload? We already have to do our first window jump of this run. And we have to buy some ammo. So I'll do that right here. Scoop up all the salvage on the way back. We have 10,000 of the normal salvage and then 1,300 of the other. That's not bad. Uh oh, gotta reload and like 50 bullets. 
Throw another one. Uh, reload right in his face. And we hit the ring of fire. I did not want to hit that. That was a waste. Ring of fire, perfect time. I am tearing through these zombies. My Lanta. They don't even have a chance. Oh! Use the cruise missile. Everyone get the fuck out of my way. All right, perfect. Are they still getting so close? I'm out of here. All right, we've made it to round 40. We have 1,996 crits. We are only 70 normal eliminations away from completing that challenge. And we are about 504 crits away from getting Dark Aether. Very close here. I think we will get it faster than we got the nail gun, but only by like a round or two. Oh shit, my ass. I need to get out of here. No! No going down. Oh fuck. I got downed right in the window seal. Okay, I'm gonna have to self-revive. And my game's frozen. My whole computer's frozen. I'm up. Holy shit. That was not good. I need elemental pop now. There's our rotten camo. We cannot lose this. We still have our quick revive, but it's borderline impossible to get a zombie down here. I'm so slow now. This is very dangerous. I definitely need to make my way back to spawn somehow. We need our perks back. We only have these zombies left. I think we can make it. Jeez. It's always after you lose stamina up, you realize how slow you actually are. All right, we got our perks back. Just barely. I bought a self-revive back. And I bought a chopper gunner. Round 41. Orta's taking his time again. He's stuck in traffic he's trying to wait for me to burn my ring of fire before he shows up because he knows i'm just gonna tear through him he doesn't want to be embarrassed there's the pack a punch full camo the 2500 kills while packed not bad round 43 and he's still not here you got some cold feet orda what's going on i might get dark aether before you show up fine i'll use the ring of fire orda is this what you wanted now he's here all right orda i only have what 130 something more crits to get i'm not a mathematician but i know me plus ring of fire equals your fuck i'm sorry that was awful let's see if we can kill orda on round 44. all right orda time for your dick appointment already doing pretty nice damage to him don't yell at me zombies are now approaching let's go ahead and take these guys out and then we'll continue with orda no get off me i gotta get him right in the fucking prolapse Let's just wipe out these zombies really quick. I'll take my crits. I'm not concerned with you, Orda. Bought some ammo. Now, Orda, it's your turn. Don't you dare shoot those things at me. He's so low. Come on. Oh, perfect. Make it easy for me. And I'll take some crits as you're dying. See ya, Orda. My bitch. Did we successfully defend it or did he blow it up before then? Oh, no, we got it champions round 45 we're 100 crits away this is the round climb the rail no climb it holy how did i get stuck on top of the rail do i need to crouch there that's ridiculous all right well there's no zombies left i actually want to exfil this so i'm gonna go ahead and grab my perks back grab a chopper gunner and i'm gonna go ahead finish these zombies off and maybe we can get it on the exfil all we need is 20 crits right that's not that bad no i didn't want to use it oh i've been playing too much apex i hit three to pull my fists out all right well that was a waste not like we don't have 18 million salvage though all right we have 14 crits to go let's try to get it on the exfil i swear if somehow i die or go down or just don't get dark aether during this exfil, I'm going to be mad, but let's just go ahead and do it. I haven't even bought this door yet. Okay, just need crits. Focus on crits, Joe. There's Gold Viper. Let's go. We can get it during the exfil. It didn't glitch out. And now we just need to finish off all these zombies in a completely platonic way. And that's all the zombies. We didn't even need to use the chopper gunner or anything to get out. Now let's go perfect game we did go down twice one of them i think was kind of bs but this gun is really good in zombies i think the, the biggest con to it is having to reload all right let's see what it looks like with dark aether here's gold viper here's plague diamond and dark aether 
very very good coverage it's a huge magazine lots of camo to be seen on there now let's go see what it looks like in game now this is what it looks like in game all dark ethered out i think it looks really really nice this is probably one of the best looking guns with dark aether honestly the mag's nice it catches your eye up here it does have that nice light pink very very good coverage on it this is it's beautiful very good looking gun and it took me about uh this this whole recording is about an hour and 31 minutes but whole game time i think that probably took me about one hour and 25 so if you have this thing fully leveled up and you sit in kernels and you just pay attention to your critical kills not that bad just an hour and a half to get a gun dark aether that's a good turnaround and it it did really really well i don't think i've ever taken out orda twice in one game and we did it there pretty easily so i think this gun's overall pretty good its biggest con is probably its movement speed without stamina up and its reload speed i did have a very large mag but it was the fast version of it probably grabbing the smaller magazine uh, would make the reload faster but probably not by a noticeable amount overall gun's pretty good that's where i'm gonna end the video if you guys like this and you want to see more leave a like on it you didn't you don't dislike if you're new here please consider subscribing put out all kinds of cod content throughout the week and that's gonna be it for me today i'll see you guys next time later